Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Menti, and this is episode 9 of the Battleship Brawl Season 7 Tournament. In this episode, we've got the Beast of Bangle by Harness. Going up against the Crown Prince, the Crown Prince, so I'm just going to call it the Prince, by Smirnov. We have to get, get that camera in position. Then we'll get the prediction started. Beast or Prince. Alright, you've got one minute to place your bets. <laughs> Honestly excited about this fight. No C was to remind me of my tragic end yesterday, right? Yesterday was C was C was C was. But yeah, let's go ahead and get this battle underway. You've got less than a minute to place your bets. We'll see how this goes. Beast of Bengal taking a big hit there. Prince taking a shower of shells. He's shell not terribly powerful individually, but there's a lot of them. needs to make a left. Stop turning right. What are you doing? There you go. Now you got your rear cannons in the mix, but it's a little late. Oh, the rear cannons instantly delete a turn off. beat up. It is down to 67% health. Look at that rare turret just getting hammered. Yep, there goes the cap. some grave though, but it's not going to be a lot. Yeah, the 
least the bangle got knocked down to 75 percent while it is winning this battle pretty dominantly it is far from the uh, the one-sided fights of yesterday's battles Barrel's doing some work though. He just blew out another turret. It's like they're made of... I don't know. I, I thought I had something for that, and then it just went away. Just popping turrets like crazy. It's like every shot blows out a turret. Pretty durable ship. I mean, it's down to 42.8% and still floating. Frisbee's gonna mad that was gonna be mad that wasn't 66.6. <laughs> the beast is a beast indeed. As expected of a harness ship. Alright, here we go, round two. at this fight. But getting knocked down to 80% and having three of your guns have not even fired a shot. 
is not great. More turning and a bit less wanting to point its nose right at the enemy. Yeah, a bit more turning in the right direction. Exactly. such a shame to watch. It has two perfectly good working guns back here that it can't use because it's facing the wrong direction. Oh, Bangle taking a big hit there. Those two shots almost broke it in half. Whatever, you know what I mean. That's what I'm saying. If, if the Prince had all of its guns on target early, like it would it would stand a decent chance of beating the beast, honestly. Like, it spends the first two minutes of the fight with only 40% of its firepower pointing at the enemy. It is a serious uh, downside. Alright, here we go.
Round three. Last chance for the Prince to do something with itself. Target. The two frontal guns still look like they're intact. actually going to have all five guns on target? Look at that, there's two turrets in the water. Oh man, imagine if the turrets were to land like a five shot volley right in here. capsizing. It finally got all its guns on target and instead it gets an 80% sinking. It got an 80% in sinking. It was low on low enough on health and went far enough down under the water that it started despawning. Eighty four point seven to zero. So I'm gonna go ahead and award the prediction real quick because the Beast of Bangle has indeed won the combat here. Oh, I think... Somebody put a 10 point bet on the prince and that was it. But I want I want to try something. I want to see something. Actually, I don't think I can do it. Crap. I thought, oh wait, yeah, I can. 90 degree spawn angle. I, I knew there was a setting for it, I just couldn't find it. Except I didn't hit apply to things, so it probably didn't work. No, it sure didn't. Let's try that again. 90 degree spawn angle, apply to team. I just want to see what happens when this thing isn't being bogged down by its turning.
head on. I tried. But it just went into the exact it just turned into it and did the exact same thing. side going on. I mean, look how much closer this battle is, though. Anyway, obviously this battle is not going to count towards anything. I just wanted to... I just wanted... I was curious. I wanted to see what would happen. Yeah, it's just a little bonus battle. Prince is still losing at the moment, but it's by a much smaller margin. has something. The prince has something. Alright, well that was an it was interesting to see what would happen. Even with that little leg up, the prince still wasn't able to beat the beast, but it was a lot closer fight. Yeah, that's true, Harness. Anyway, that'll be the end of this episode, folks. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you on the battlefield.